Welcome back. We have Queen Brooke, and we've got Larry here to join us to talk about the Newport Hill Climb. It's not taking place this weekend, but the following weekend. That's October 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. This is the 43rd year for this event. Yes. You must be doing something right. Well, we, the Lions Club must be doing something <laughs> right. We're not sure sometimes how it comes off, but it just kind of all falls together and happens at the last minute. I don't think we could stop it if we wanted to. <laughs> so many people look forward to this, just watching those antique cars go up that big hill. It's so impressive. It really is. It is. I mean, so we, we've got some Model Ts driving around in a tour this weekend. These cars are 100 years old. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've got some 1909 and older vehicles. So you're thinking something that was made 100 years ago and has been restored or kept in good enough mechanical condition to get up the hill. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not really in good enough mechanical <laughs> condition to get up the hill, but I'll make a few treks up and down with my, my shooter bakers next week. But, um, Your shooter bakers. They'll be like kind that. of wore out. Yeah, they'll be kind of wore out before the week's <laughs> over. But The um, cars just stand the test of time. They really do. And, and some of these guys, they're fanatics about mm -hmm. you know keeping them accurate, restored, original, perfect, and, and running. Uh, and that, that's something that I think has been part of our secret of success is it's not a car show where you just take it and park it. Mm -hmm. You're actually using it to what it was designed for. It was designed to drive. Okay. And uh, I think that's part of the, the unique thing about it. You're seeing these old cars and, and they're doing, they're running. They're not just museum piece that, mm -hmm. you know, a lot of museum pieces don't actually run. But these you know, have to meet all the requirements to run up and down the road and have a license plate and have insurance and all uh -huh. that. And, and they're... Uh, it's amazing. It's, it's fascinating. And if you have an antique vehicle, you can still compete. It's not too late to register your vehicle. That's right. You can register right up till 10 o'clock Sunday morning. <laughs> right to the last minute. And there'll be some guys that are still tinkering on theirs <laughs> at 9 o'clock Sunday morning trying Just to get it to it. run to get it there. Yes. <laughs> I won't mention any names. And Queen Brooke, you have um, been crowned and you're going to give up the crown this weekend. But um, what an adventure for you. It's been very exciting. It's been the most enriching experience I've ever been through. Uh -huh. I've met a lot of great people. And it's going to be sad to probably hand over that crown. Yes. Yes. But you're going to attend, right? You're going to be there. I am. I'll we're, be there. We're going to put it to work. Hey. Hey, that doesn't sound so hot. <laughs> <laughs> we need to talk about a special raffle that you're going to have yes. this year. This is something new. Right? No, nope. no. We've done this for years. Okay. Yep. Just but this a, different is a different vehicle. Different vehicle. Well, let's year. take a look because we have a picture. There we go. There we go. Complete with the queen. 39 <laughs> Ford, 39 Ford pickup, queen not included, got the famous flathead Ford V8 engine, runs like a top. Starts very hard, you turn the key, you push the button, barely, and it's running and just quiet as a mouse. I'm going to hate to see that thing leave town. It's such a f ball to drive. How much for a raffle ticket? A uh, buck a piece, six tickets for $5, and you can drive her home. You can run up the hill and win a trophy. Hey, even leave. better. You can win the raffle prize and win. That'd be cool. If you have any questions, 765-492-4220, or jump on the internet and go to NewportHillClimb.com. It's $5 for a parking fee. Admission is absolutely free. Go check it out October 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. Thank you, Queen Brooke and Larry. Thank you. We'll be right back.